What's good, crazy emulation? We back at it with another emulation video. This is NCAA AA14 running on the ROG. My game ran really good. You, you see, I'm running two different modes. You'll see first quarter I'm running 18 watts, second quarter we're gonna run 25. Now, obviously, um, you can run it both ways. If you really want that extra consistency at 60, then run that turbo. But in my opinion, game runs fine at 18. I don't really have that many issues with it. Um, maybe you can put it at a lock 20, but yeah, it is what it is, right? Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, subscribe, and as always, leave requests. And I'll see y'all the next one. EA Sports. It's in the game. I also want to let you guys know that at a certain point of video, you'll see me going with the menu trying to hit the exhibition game. And the problem was I forgot that I was playing two player and it set the RG to both controls at the same time. So I've got to turn that off. So you'll see me going through that. I also want to keep in mind that this game had a lot of shaders still. So please do keep that in mind. surface we're at arizona stadium looking forward to a great contest this coin toss presented by nissan innovation that excites and the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Second down. an offense so much more versatile. It's first and ten. Ball on the 49-yard line. 98 Weasel! 98 Weasel! Gets it out quickly. And he's tackled at the 47-yard line. to the right. There's a strike complete, and he shoved out of bounds around the 28-yard line. From the 28-yard line, it's first down. On the run. 
Push down of bounds at the 11 yard line. The offensive coordinator has to be elated with the way his offense right now is executed. They're not in a hurry, but they're very, very methodical and very consistent with their approach. It's a third first down that they've picked up on this drive. Throws to the right to his fullback. He's knocked out of bounds around the five yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. Wiley will run it again. They'll bring him down at the two. Defense stacked in tight here. And they make the stop at the one. The halfback picks up a yard. Lyman hopes for an opportunity to impose his will on the defense. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So a 10 play, 72 yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run in the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown. So the score now, 7 0. It's a short kickoff. He's to the 40. And he's taken down at the 49. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. They'll spread the field with five wide. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. From the 46 yard line, it's second down. Throws out to the back, and he can't hold on to it. That was textbook coverage by the defense. That's exactly what you want to do on every single pass play, but it doesn't always happen. And this is going to be a first down. And he's taken down at the 33. Great job by the quarterback. He had a slant called against zone coverage and threw it at the perfect time. From the 33-yard line, first down. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. Short pass, middle of the field. A risky call going for it, but it paid off. That showed some real composure there by this offense. This is the eighth play of this drive. And down he goes, around the 26-yard line. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. A long way yet to go, but at the end of one, the Wildcats with a touchdown lead. He's got it with room to run. Tackle around the nine yard line. That makes it first. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. That's 
a great tackle at the 13. I love to see this, Brad. These cornerbacks have the toughest job in college football, and that's to cover some of the fastest players on the field, the receivers. And for a corner willing to come up, get off of his block, and make a play to disrupt the run, that's as good as it gets if you're a defensive coordinator. He's tackling at the five. Here's the 12th play of the drive. A gain of a yard of the quarterback keeper. This one should be makeable. It's up, and it splits the uprights. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 20-yard line. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Arizona is up by four. Fakes the handoff. Defense coming. Slings it. He's taken down around the 37-yard line. From their own 37-yard line, first down. confidence to get tackled for a loss but this guy knows that he's got to just keep at it and the holes will start to open up from their own 33 yard line third down he's rolling right fires quickly to the tight end and he is drilled at the 34 yard line Second down. They bring him down in the backfield. Arizona is up four. Here comes the pressure. He's wrapped up for the sack. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. He'll try to change the field position and especially not get it to the end zone. He heaves it deep. Almost picked off. So they turn it over on downs, and that's a big boost for this defense. In a close game like this one, it's big plays like this that can be the deciding factor. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And a quick throw. He's at the 40. Tackle made at the 36. First and 10. Ball on the 36. Quick throw. And he's tackled at the 23. I tell you what, this defense better start to get pressure on the quarterback. They're giving him way too much time back there to throw the football. They come out in a five wide set. They'll bring him down at right around. 
the 14-yard line. I think it was a great play call. It was very well executed. Any coach would be happy with that kind of outcome on a first or second down play. So it's second down and about two yards to go. And that sets them up with a first and goal. Five wide. And he just gets rid of it. From the one yard line. Second down. Zips it to his receiver. Touchdown. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three point lead with this extra point. And he adds the extra point. A six play, 53 yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. Brad, I love these kind of drives. They're old school, grind it out and earn the yards and just rip the heart right out of that defense. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 14. You know, we're getting so used to pinball football with a lot of points. Kind of fun to see defenses play this well. Kind of refreshing, isn't it? I mean, every single week we call games and you're seeing scores in the 30s and 40s. This is one of those low-scoring games. Which offense will get that big break? Eventually, it could be the team that wins it. Fires it quickly. It's incomplete. I'm not so sure he made the best decision that time. That was a pretty tight area he was trying to throw that one into. It's second and ten. Ball on their own 14. They'll work the right side, and there's nothing going there. He's hit and taken down. Points were very hard to come by in those first two quarters. They'll head to the locker room. 10-7, Lobo. Hope you guys enjoyed the we gameplay. Please Glad leave a like and subscribe. Keep requesting videos, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.